Hi there, it's Keith with the Advanced Features uh, tab video. What we've got here is uh, just a couple of things to do. We need to choose whether or not we want to auto-highlight the primary keyword or not. It's your call and you can make it whichever way suits what you want to do, you can make it. Let me explain that a little bit further. Auto-highlighting the primary keyword will highlight that primary keyword let's use this example car donation on every single article that those words appear in that format so it will highlight in either bold italic or underlined and if there are three instances or more it will only highlight one italic one bold and one underline it won't go and do any more. The reason we've done that is the search engines like to know what's important and underlining is different to bolding and bolding is different to italics therefore the search engines will look at them and they will appreciate that they have a value and that that value is in independent of each of the others whereas if you bold everything the search engines will probably end up being a bit confused. So we've done that deliberately and um, we get good uh, search engine uh, kudos from it. We also include a snippet uh, as, a, as a habit. The reason for the snippet is we like to uh, just pop an extra bit of information on each page. It's automatically set to 300 but we choose 200. Again it's just choice um, you could choose probably 500 or 100, it's, it's personal choice so we do that. And we also tend to choose random snippets so that uh, the search engines see a little bit more happening on each page. Over here you can put a pop-up window on, on your site and you can put the uh, HTML text in here relevant to the pop-up window and of course you'd always need to put in a title and the reason you put in a title is that tells the visitor what to what freebie they're getting or what they get for putting their name into the pop-up down here you can inject links on any uh, paid product that you want uh, it might be as simple as a Clickbank product you might just put in uh, car donation X Clickbank and then the URL and that would be your uh, Clickbank ID uh, we would tend to cloak that of course uh, so that you can protect your commissions but uh, it's nice and easy you just type in whatever the word is that you're looking like an anchor text and the actual actual link making sure that there is a space between them and that's done uh, also we also tick the uh, the box here to make sure that the we match the plural terms for the auto highlighting of the keywords and that's that tab, so we'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.